Here we present our work on resilient leg local navigation. In this work, we train our goal condition navigation policy to guide our legged robot to desired goals, even under corrupted perception, by interacting with the environment. Existing navigation. Methods commonly assess traversability of the environment based on litter or camera data. The so-called exteroception, a velocity command is produced to the locomotion policy, which controls the robot actuators. The proprioceptive information is commonly only available to the locomotion, but not the navigation module. This paradigm works well when the exteroception is reliable, but fails when it's corrupted. Here, we simulate a sensor failure where the box is not correctly detected by the robot. To tackle this problem, we propose to train a local navigation policy fully end-to-end -end in simulation. Our method feeds back the proprioceptive information used to train the locomotion policy to our proposed navigation policy. The proprioceptive information includes the motion states of the robot, corresponding to the physical environment. This allows the navigation policy to detect the mismatch between the provided exteroception and the real physical environment through interaction or, in simple words, by touching the obstacles. More specifically, the exteroception is in the form of a robot-centric traversability cost map, and the proprioception consists of base linear velocity, base angular velocity, base acceleration, projected gravity, joint positions, joint velocities, and joint torques. To simulate the corrupted exteroception cases, we deliberately mask the obstacles and pits, rendering them invisible to the robot. We trained the policy in NVIDIA's Isaac Gym, utilizing a curriculum of different terrains with increasing difficulty levels. As training progresses, the number of invisible obstacles and pits is increased. Additionally, we randomized the robot collision body to introduce various collision scenarios. We show that our method results in sophisticated emerging local navigation strategies in response to invisible obstacles and pits. Additionally, we compare our method to a state-of-the-art local planner in simulation. Our method performs on par with the classical planner under perfect perception, but strongly outperforming the classical planner when faced with invisible obstacles and pits. Our policy successfully transfers to the real world. Here, we manually disable all the vision systems. The robot efficiently detects collisions, whether they occur at the base front or side thigh, leg, or in multi-contact scenarios, showcasing its generalization capabilities. Thanks a lot for your attention.